Hello everyone, this is Arnheim Primer here back in back in review a Transformer figure. Today we're gonna be on Transformers War for Cybertron Siege Warrior Class Lord Megatron And here is now before we start I know you can say he looked kinda different than look like how you look in the the how you look in the toy form, but actually I kind of changed the tank modes because because I I didn't I, because I think the I don't a big fan of the sword because I think Megatron don't need the big sword sword because I think he because, because you know Megatron he don't need that type of that big sword for him because I don't, well I I, I hope because for me I rather see him with the wrecking ball that's a more classic. Of Megatron and here's the new look for Megatron and Tech Mode. If you want to know what happened to the sword, I just gave it to the sword to Mortal Master, the Combined Awards, because I, I kind of like his lot of weapons, so so I can use. Well, I so now I can use Megatron to add his primary sword for him. So yeah, so here is so let back to the review of this figure. Now, before we start, let before we start, let's take a look at the package. Okay, here, here is the package: Transformers Siege, Wolf of Cybertron, Transformers. Here, his name, right here. Hit the symbol. All of our logo made by Hasbro and Takara Tomy. Hasbro logo right here. The bottom, nothing. Here's it. Here's the side of the package. The night great uncle of of our Lord is Megatron. This side here's a not a great artwork of the Transformers or for Cybertron Netflix series that is coming up very soon, and I can't wait to see, see that show. I hope it's good. And here back of the package. You can you see he can do this, do that, have seventeen steps, and you can use if you have like those Titan um the talking master whatever you want to call them, you can give him the weapon for them or and you some though if those the fire powers effect things on him but. But it's Megatron. He, he don't need any type of web web. He don't need anything like that. So yeah, there is the package, and here the top the Decepticon logo, and yeah, there is the package. And let's start review this figure, shall shall we? Put him down. Here is Megatron, and I gotta say I I'm kind of big. I I really like the tech mode. Yeah, I think this um, I think the take more it kind of suits for Megatron and how he look. Well, he never how this isn't how he look in the old, old cartoon show. He transformed to a tank, but I mean a gun. But if if they never gave him a gun one, this is probably how he look in the G one cartoon show. And this is how he look in the look how you look in Transformers Devastation. So yeah, there is the here is the take mode. Let's look at the pink one. Here he has some nice pink one on his on his on the side of his tank. He has some yellow right here on his tail light. On the side, yeah, more brown and pink on the tank tank tread. He got some red right here, red right there, there and there. But those meant for the robot mode. And you got some little black right there. And more paint right here. And you, you hear you got some redder, some redder scratches paint on his tank mode, but tank mode. And I kind of like it. It kind of suits of of Megatron. This this I don't mind, but this I don't mind. They do like something like this, like like you don't see it. But, but, 
but this one's big this becomes shorter um I don't mind that way but I understand people don't like the, these things because it's trying to ruin the figure because they, they want to like like clean Megatron but but well this is called what what Cybertron siege siege anyway so you, of course you're gonna get like scratching and be dirty in in the war and yeah here is the tank here the so a rotation of the tank mode you can go up and down you can go side side to side and that and there's his his articulation on your tank mode so yeah there is the top and there is the bottom you can see his head right there and yeah now for comparison here is my my own, my other only Warper Cybertron Deluxe Size Swipe. So the size is kind of accurate and accurate because Megatron is supposed to be bigger and and taller than these Autobots. And yeah, there is a comparison. And let's start training from this bad boy to his rubber mode. Shall we? Let. So let's really take off his 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 user cannon and we put this off the side and let's begin. First, we come here for on tablets the tablets one I saw for this one being the hinge all the way like that and you got rotate roll it which like this well you already seen this his how he transform him already so you already know how he, you probably already know how to transform him so you I probably know how to show you how to transform him but yeah, for this, bring the hinge back here, rotate uh, like that, bring this up, bring in the knee and rotate and here is, and here is his, and here is your feet all done, no, come, like pull back his toes up, his up body I'll tap this one that and this tab, a slot right there bring this all way and put his tank tread back there would hit his desktop and bring these things down these rotated and fold his fist in there and to complete the look for his future can on this side you can hold he, you can make him hold it but and you can pull up here but I think it's better like this and there and here is Megatron on his greatest robot mode and for, when I forgot I'm not a big fan of his robot mode because I feel like his chest is like too wide and too big buffy but but when I got it in person I, I kind of like this this figure because I was gonna get the last night Megatron to be my favorite Megatron figure but well, I had no choice to get him, but to get this Megatron, and I kind of like it now. And here is Megatron. Like close down to his face. Very nice G1 accurate head sculpt. Here is his boxer head. 
You got you got some nice black on his his eyelash. You got some red on his eye. Some silver print on his face. You got more more scratchy water right there on his face. And some here. This is the Subicon logo. You got some blue right there. Some yellow. Some more red right here. And some red. More ready right here on his arms and his his leg as well. He has some dog grade right here. In the bag, well, very clean backpack. Well, you, you kind of expect to make a well, not like he. They don't want to choice to do that because I I don't mind like this. And yeah, yeah, got some more silver paint back there as well. And yeah, there is Megatron. Now for articulation wise, his head is on a ball joint. He goes side to side. He go up. Well, as it do, you know, when you go up a little bit and go down, but you can use this make him go look up, but it make but well, it will make it a little bit ugly and doesn't look very really well making pose of, of that. He can go 360. He's on a, I believe, on a a mushroom pack. Yeah, that's a mushroom pack right there. He goes side to side. He go up that far. He's on. He go swivel. His face can go like just like this. He go side. He change. I mean, his future can go swivel. If he can go have a silver as well, his feet can go up. I mean, his leg go go up, up that far. Can make a a split. Another silver right here, and then bent knee right here, and and you can do something like this. in the feet you can pivot back a little bit. Go. And his feet can do like this. And yeah, there is always all his articulation. And you might give a nice poses of this figure. And yeah, that, now let's start with a comparison of all his. I hear him with side swipe. Hear him with one of the seekers I have, the Rainmaker. He's one of, one of them. He was, as a stone. Pretty good skill right there. I really like that. And I don't have the the original. I don't have the stocking one. So. So imagine him with the stocking right there, and here is the Shockwave. From Resident from Transformer Prime. I'm not gonna pick up the shotgun because I kind of like this figure more better than the other one because I don't want to buy like like the same characters every time. So I just buy I just bought this shotgun because he I like the design of him in the show. So yeah. So it's him here, here with with shockwave. And that is and that's all, all I want to say this figure. Great, great figure, great remote, great transformation, great everything about this figure. I think this is one of, the, I don't, know, one of the top ten best Megatron figures we have. And this figure have a lot of repainted paint every time of this lineup, but. And yeah, I can't wait how we gonna how we gonna be, how we he gonna handle in the Transformers show. The Netflix series, and I cannot wait for it. So there is my my review on Transformers, Seas, Warbird, Cybertron, Megatron, Voyager class, and this all I want to say is transform and roll out. <laughs>